Hi, Scorpios. So the last reading I did, I was getting that someone wants to come back, but they want to do it the right way. They want to be loyal, stable. Um, they might be choosing you over a karmic partner, maybe like a third party situation for some of you. But let's see what the cards have to say. Yeah, apology, regret. They want to apologize for their mistakes. Um, there might be some anger and miscommunication that they want to apologize for as well. Risk, reward, bold gesture, choosing love over fear. So that's good energy. Isolation, loneliness, emptiness. The grass was not greener on the other side for them. They're wanting to reconcile. Sorry. Here we go. Nostalgia. Loyalty, stability, vows. Codependency, addiction. It really feels like they know that they need to make some positive life choices and come back to you the right way, but they're kind of getting impatient because they miss you so much. So it's kind of like a back and forth energy here. Like they want to apologize and express regret for something that they did wrong here. They want to choose love over fear, but it's almost like a spur of the moment kind of decision, like a like king or queen of wands, like coming in very quickly. And part of it is out of loneliness and codependency. Sadly, like part of it, I mean, they feel alone without you. They feel empty without you. They're missing you. They're nostalgic for you. They're longing for you. They're kind of codependent when it comes to you, kind of addicted to you. And they want to reconcile with you. They want to be loyal, stable. They want to make these promises. They just need to come about it the right way. And I think they're kind of back and forth on the way to come about, like on the way to come in. Because I think that... I think sometimes it's like the emotion just kind of overwhelms them and they're like, oh, I just want to like, they just want to like get drunk or just, you know, act on emotion and just like message you or call you and just see what's going on. Like they don't like the silence or the, the distance between you guys right now. Um, but then at the same time, like they kind of know that they need to come back the right way, that they need to make sure that they've broken toxic patterns, that they've really... If, if it is a third party situation, like they want to make sure they're completely done with the karmic, like all the drama with the karmic is over with, like they're free to date someone new. Um, or I mean, you know, you could be like an ex. I mean, I'm sure you're probably an ex for them for most of you. But you know what I mean? Like they need their energy free from the karmic for whatever that third party situation was that was keeping them away from you. It could be a job or something else as well, but whatever it might be. It's like they're really torn on how to come in because it's like it feels like because it's 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 like the same it's similar energy to what I was getting a couple weeks ago but before it was like they were really wanted to come back correctly like they're wanting to come back loyal and stable like you know completely done with the karmic like they've cut him or her out like they've you know gotten closure like they've moved if they've lived together they've moved out or they've if they shared finances like they've gotten their finances together and separated from that or they found a new job or you know something of that sort like they want to they want to make sure that they have a stable low offer to present you but now it feels like something's happened that's made them emotional and like they want they need you there like maybe something just upsetting just happened to some of them like could be like a death in the family or it could be um like job loss or just general stress something something has happened has maybe has happened that made them feel like isolated and alone and upset and they're just wanting their support system because they just sense like they logically they know they need to get their life together and make sure like everything's all squared away before they come back to you. And that's what they want to do. They want to be able to come back loyal and stable. Some of them have issues with cheating. Some of them have cheated on you in the past and they want to break that pattern. And so they're wanting to make sure that they don't just impulsively come back. They want to make sure they can actually like commit to a long term relationship and be stable and not end up you know, breaking your heart or cheating and betraying you again. Like they want to make sure they can do it right. But this feels like more of an impulsive energy. This feels like something shifted where they're like, I mean, they're still, the, the desire is still there. They're still 
wanting to come back to you, but they're wanting to just come forward more quickly now. Like they're just kind of like, like screw it. Even if the karmic relationship isn't fully over, or even if like we haven't moved out yet, or even if, you know, there's still drama there, like screw it. I just, I miss my person. I want to talk to them. I need them here. I'm going through a lot. Um, or like, you, you know what I mean? Like they're, they're, they were focusing on getting their lives together and they were like, okay, down the road, they're going to come back to you like a few months later or, or even like a year later, like once they're really like secure, everything's good. Like that's when they're, you know, that's when they're wanting to come back around. Like when, when, you know what I mean? Like when they feel like it could be solid, like they want to do it right, but it's like, they're codependent on you. So they're kind of having like a little breakdown right now where they just want to be with you where they're just like okay screw it like no I don't have everything together but I miss my person I need my person I'm nostalgic I'm upset they just want to reconcile like right now even if they know they're not completely ready for it they're still just like they don't want to be away from you another minute yeah they want to do start with you know, like adventure honeymoon vacation um bringing the passion and romance back to the connection um it could be like a soulmate past life connection Pulling them in, taking it slow, getting to know each other. Yeah, you know, like starting over is kind of the energy I'm getting. Like they're wanting to to start over here. Like they're wanting a fresh beginning. Choose a path. And if this is your story and you want a private reading, just send me an email. My email is um, below in the description box. Any donations are also appreciated. And the, my donation links are also below in the description box, right below this video. Yeah, fa yeah, choosing a path. So fast moving energy, chaos, sudden term events, passion, romance. I think they're kind of like sex, seduction. I feel like they're kind of wondering like, can they come in quickly? Can there just be a sudden change of events? And can they come in quickly and still make it work? Like, can they just have the passion and romance? Or is it not logical? Do they need to better their lives and, and figure their figure their life out first? Like, they're kind of worried. They're like, they're, they're missing you so much. And they're, I really feel like something happened because I get like a very like frantic emotional energy from them. So like either something bad just happened to them and they're really upset and they want you because you're like their support system. Like they want to talk to you about it. They want their best friend there. Or, um, or I mean, they're just generally missing you, you know, but it, it feels like they're, they're wondering like, can, can you guys make this work? Like, can you have this passionate, romantic new start? Um, or is it going to be chaos? Like, are they going to, like, say they cheated on you before and maybe they wanted to take some time alone to make sure that they could really end that pattern of cheating. They're like, okay, like, they're, they're thinking about it now. They're like, could I come back to my person and actually be loyal and be passionate and romantic and, like, not lose that feeling, not not lose that energy and actually, like, stay with them for the long haul this time? Like, they want to make sure they could do it right. They don't want to just... They're really torn between, you know, long term and like acting impulsively. Like they're really, they just wish they could talk to you right now. They really, they're really, yeah, they're really confused, really lost, really upset about something, really wishing they could talk to you right now. New perspective. Yeah, the karmic is trying to deceive some of them into not leaving, but they, they know where their home is. They don't want to deal with that anymore. They know that their feelings with you are mutual. It's an interesting reading. Hmm. Yeah, it's just, I get that energy. They're so torn. Like, they really want to reach out now because they just, they just, it's, you ever just, like, need someone there in the present moment? Like, you just don't care if it's logical or not. You don't care if your life isn't together. You just, like, you just in that energy and that emotion, that raw emotion, that passion. You're, like, they just, like, like an addiction. Like, they just, they just need you there. They just need to be cuddling with you to, you know, like, they might miss the sex, too. Like, they just need to be close to you. Like, they just can't even, like, handle it right now. Like, they can't handle how much they missed you like they're so overwhelmed with this emotion right now that's why I'm really feeling like something must have happened and it's like they're just they feel like alone like they don't have their support system you know they're just like or maybe because I feel them panicking so maybe for some of them maybe you're like 
talking to other people or something's happening that's making them panic and be like, okay, I just have to get them back now because I don't have time to wait and better my life and present a stable you know, solid offer. Like I don't have time to do all that. Like I just need to get them back now before they date someone else. Like maybe something is making them panic. Maybe like mutual friends told them you're talking to someone else or something of that sort could have happened as well. There's just some kind of energy where they feel a sense of ur urgency. Like they just, they need to be with you right now. Like they just, they have to be with you now. Um, what else? Clubs, parties, social life, pause, reflection, rest. Yeah. Some of them are trying to take a break from that. Like they're Maybe they partied a lot or they had addictions for, for a couple of them. And now they're like, they're focusing on their, their true love instead. Probably just for like a couple of you. What else? Vulnerability, receptivity. Yeah, I feel like some of them are just like confused about whether you're, about what you're feeling. If you're still vulnerable to them, you know, like. Like domination control, just like trying to figure out what role to be in here. Um, so yeah, it's an interesting energy. I mean, they do really miss you. So I wouldn't be surprised if you, if some of you get like a drunk text out of the blue, cause they're just, whatever is going on with them. I don't know. It's, it's chaotic. It's like, it's like, it's intense. Like they're just like filled with emotion right now. Like just, you might be feeling this energy too and picking up on their energies and like not knowing where it's coming from. It's like, they just feel like they just have to talk to you right now for whatever reason. So, um, like I said, if you want a private reading, my email is below, just send me an email and thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if it resonates.